here we introduce use case then safe function out of the context right by also in the domain of the railway industry in the railway control system we have a hierarchy of systems from control center computer interlocking system of the weight side object which you can see in the bottom railway systems require a stringent life cycle and assessment to be safe for public use in a values project, we, we introduce railway safe system in the use case then to find new approaches based on the novel verification and validation methodologies to reduce the certification time. For our use case demonstrator, we chose a point machine motor controller, which is a part of the signaling systems. As presented earlier, in the railway control system is the integration of a hierarchy of a various system from interlocking system to a side object such as point machine. As you can see, motor controller receives order and transmit messages from and to the upper hand interlocking system to drive the motor accordingly. In our demonstrated, we design a grid to mimic the behavior of the interlocking system to send and send the orders and receive messages to the motor controller. Previously, the railway platform was comprised of a discrete components to meet required safety. And in this project, we try to investigate the state-of-the-art FPGA associates such as Zinc Ultra Scale Plus as the sole platform for, um, for our demonstrator. On the right side, there is a power electronics and actuated to drive the point machine. Designing a control system compliance with the railway standards is a huge undertaking, and this certificate introduced rigorous product life cycle. Therefore, designing a compliant and safety accredited product meeting SIL4 with tolerable hazard rate of five times 10 to power of minus 12 is time consuming and costly, and requires high level of verification and validation. In values project, we try to investigate new BNB methodology to reduce the certification process and cost yet maintaining the compatibility with the norms. With values novel methods, we investigate and validate the safety functions implemented on two different platforms and try to move the safety functions between environments and assess the compliance with the railway standards. With this approach, we explore the possibility to reduce the time uh, and cost of the functional safety product development in the railway system. Also, the possibility to increase the system availability is explored. For a VNB methodology, in our use case, we use UPAL model checker to model the system in a high level to check for aliveness of safety properties and check for possible scenarios which could lead to deadlocks in the software. Another VNB tool which we use is the Healing Core. Healing Core is an in-house tool provided by KTH University as an IP in the RAM-based FPGAs to perform runtime reconfiguration in case of occurrence of a cell. Also, it introduces runtime fault injection in the FPGA. With the Healing Core, associate platform certification process can be expedited. Another methodology is the model-based testing that can assist the tester in generation of a required manual or automatic test cases. In short, new methodologies are promising and can reduce the life cycle of the railway products.